Hello everybody, welcome back to Ben on the Landscapes. So spring is finally here, fingers crossed. The rain has stopped, it's been raining for the last three days, and the daffodils are starting to show. So I just wanted to go through a shrub here with you that, you know, some people are quite worried about cutting back, and uh, you know, this time of year, mid-March, is the time to do it. So this here is a lavender, also known as lavendula or angustifolia, uh, augustifolia, and it's um, also, you know, people worry about how far, far to cut it back. As you can see now, as it, with it being mid-March, it's, um, it's starting to show some new growth. You might not be able to see it in the camera there, but um, it's, a, it's a very leggy shrub. So if you leave it for, for a year or two to, to get you know, too high up, then it's just going to get woody and you're not going to get the most out of your foliage. So what you can do is this time of year, um, you'll start to see this, this, uh, the new growth coming through from the base. And if you do have that new growth low down, then take that opportunity, opportunity when the frost is all cleared to just cut it above those the tops of that new growth there, um, and that will rejuvenate the, the shrub so that you can, you know, get that that foliage back from the base of the plant rather than it growing too high up, and um, and you know, and getting woody from down below because you'll only have this this top bit of foliage there otherwise. So just make sure to cut it right back above them, and also just make sure that you do it after the frost. Um, otherwise, you'll cut that that uh, above that new growth. It'll grow up, be tender, and the frost will hit it, and you'll lose that growth. And, you know, that that whole year's foliage might be gone. So. Um, it's as simple as that. Just, uh, yeah, don't worry too much. Be ruthless with the lavender as long as you've got that new growth lower down. So I hope that helps. You can follow us on twitter.com forward slash Ben Lanoy uh, or also on facebook.com forward slash Ben Lanoy Scapes or as usual, just go to the website at benlanoy.com. Hope that helps. See you again next time. Bye.